Well, hello, here we are in Maasai land. It's September 24th. We're setting up our hotel for the night. And this is for all of you who don't believe the Cleavers can camp. How many of you camped in Maasai land, setting up your tent and having to clear cow dung to make room for your tent? Thorns. Any more clearing to do? Let's see that again. <laughs> That's for real. Hey! What are you uh, doing? I am picking up firewood. We're camping, looking, scrummaging through Maasai land, getting firewood. I'm trying to avoid the huge piles of cow dung. And 50 feet down and no water yet, so they're using dynamite to loosen up the dirt. Hopefully find water. We uh, are now back to our Hotel Maasai. We're right here. Camping. Camping. And our new friend James and his family lives right over there. He's a pastor. He's a pastor. And our new friend Byron, West Mott alum, is with us too. We're with him. Hi. <laughs> leading the charge here. <laughs> Byron's going to go through our menu for tonight. Yes, tonight we're having uh, beef stew, potatoes, French. <laughs> And then a little bit of rice. Got some rice cooking over there. Cooking over there, and for dessert we will have dried pineapple and maybe a little tea. And we had an appetizer, yes. the uh, dried safari snack banana chips and beef jerky. It was excellent. Great meal. We've got a visitor. <laughs> Hi, David Al. In, in Karai, no? We were thinking of you. Camping. Wish you were here. You love we might have to take Z. We'll take Z with us uh, next time. <laughs> So Ooh. say hello Jaime. Hello Jaime. <laughs> <laughs> Just wrapping up our campfire here. We got you some visitors. Samuel. What's your name? Samuel. Samuel and what's your name? Ayango. Huh? Ayango. We're having some fun with uh, taking pictures of taking headshots and showing some of We did mouths, we did ears, and we're learning English in Maasai, in, in Gomo. In Gome? In, in, in Gomo? In Gomo? In Gomo. Gomo. Well, we did it. We camped. <laughs> we camped. <laughs> It's just you and me, our tent, and the stars. No hotel. No hotel. No soft water bed. We do have a mattress. It's very comfortable. We had a wonderful time. And how many people can say that a a Maasai warrior came and visited them <laughs> during their campfire. About 20 minutes ago, the uh, cows walked by with their bells. 
You can guess that. What do you think, honey? It was a great experience. I do think there's a fly in here buzzing around. Yeah, there is. There. And I know that Dave and Allison would never have that. They would have set up their tent in such a way to keep the flies out. <laughs> we'll have to learn that next time. Byron delivered some bees, so the women are dividing up what they want to take and what they don't need, and there's some extras in the car. These are the women that make beads, uh, ornaments for that we're selling at CA. So uh, that's what they're doing right now. They left home at 5 a.m. to walk here. It's what, yeah. almost 11? Yeah. And they'll put them on their donkeys and take them home. Uh-uh. Yeah.